Did you go home? Nice and toasty. Alright, well uh, today we are going adventuring, but we're also going to add a competitive element. So you guys will be having a team surf off, representing your clubs, the best little beaches that we can find in this beautiful uh, coastline. And uh, yeah, you're going to be taking it to each other. So we're all going to jump in the wheels, go adventuring and uh, find a good little pocket of pump and surf where you guys get to flare it up. You ready to go? Sounds great. Awesome. We're gonna go. Let's go. Let's do it. Love a good beachy. But I reckon we'll go check this other little corner. Okay. We're gonna go uh, to a little secret bank in the very north corner of one of the beaches, and uh, there's a lot of beaches around here, so we're not gonna give away any secrets. Undisclosed location. Spot X, as they say. Send us on this special mission to find the dome-shaped rock. Apparently gives you special powers. Special surfing powers. Oh, look at right hand point break. Ooh, Mate, that is surreal. You don't want to give Reggie too much of an advantage on the beach break stuff. <laughs> Are you kidding? I reckon the tag team's like out there, surely. Alright you guys, the Dometic Adventure continues with the big event of the entire weekend. It's the Tag Team Challenge. This is the big one. This is the grand final rematch. The format is going to be this. Half hour heats, the best ride of both your men and women added together for your total. We're going to have two heats. First versus third from the final, second versus fourth. So first heat will be Burley versus Liebar. Second heat will be North Shelley versus the North Shore. Just make sure that your team gets into this battle box before the heat runs out of time or you'll cop a four point deduction. Righto, let's kick this off. Do it for your club. Go, buddy! Up our heat's big stuff. While the laid back camping vibes have been fun, when this crew throws on a rashy, you know they mean business. Uh, a 6.25 for your score. How do you feel about that? Mate, it's pretty good. Just get out there and get it done. Yeah. Sit it up for Isla to go out and smash out a good 7.5, I reckon. Calling one. <laughs> oh, one more, one more. Get up there. What's it going to take to beat these guys? We're going to have to rip. We're going to have to rip to get yeah. it done. Macy and Joel, they're world class surfers, so you're going to have to do some world class surfing. Yo, look at this thing. Holly. Big and sexy Larry. Oh, make it. Oh, oh that's big. Oh, good. Go, Macy. Go, Macy. She's on a dog. Sick. All right, highest score of the day so far. Woo. All right, Al. Get it done. Sick. Bring it home. Don't, don't See you out there, bro. Wait, how long is that? Shaw secures their spot alongside Burley to go head to head in the grand final, whilst North Shelley and Liebar battle it out for the rose gold bronze. gets it, just. Congrats. All right, you guys, welcome to the Dometic Adventure final. Let's give it everything you got, guys. Yeah.
Yeah, we're just driving back from our Dometic Tag Team Challenge. Oh, I just went to left it. You want it? Yeah, we want it, yeah. <laughs> Good start. Yeah, we're pretty stoked. Isla was our bloody anchor woman again that just... No, Maddie was team carry. <laughs> Maddie job. Yeah, he gets the job done. That's what they say about him. He's just so reliable. I mean, in a team atmosphere, every team needs someone who they can really anchor on and he is always going to deliver. He is underrated for how good he serves. He is just super explosive. The foundations are all there and when he comes off the bottom and hits the lip, it stays hit. It's just, uh, yeah, he's a powerful little unit and uh, he's definitely someone everyone looks at with envy when they see how good a team player is. Aside from that though, Isla Huppert. Yeah, she rips. She is, uh, I don't really know how to describe her other than kind of like mind blowing. She surfed out of her skin at the ABB finals for Burley, pulled off probably the turn of the event, won the Lane Beachley medal. Um, she's from Victoria originally, now living up at Burley, represents the club so well, represents her family beautifully, and I think a star on the rise for sure. Oh, Isla's a champion, eh? I just love surfing with her. She's so competitive, she just wants to win. Um, in a, and that's just what you want in a teammate. You just want someone that's dedicated and just, if you say you're going, she goes. <laughs> Uh, if anyone spent time in Burr, they know it's a pretty community-based place. Like we all just love surfing, we love surfing the point, and it's probably like all the other clubs. It's just the support and how the community comes together. Like that's kind of why we're all so involved in it because we just want to see your friends and want to support everyone, you know, through through surfing or through like other factors of life. Like that's just what a, a sports club's all about. Burley has like supported girls surfing so much and like us moving up from Vico they were so welcoming and stuff so it was like nice to give back to them a little bit you know. We took the, the Burley spirit from the hill to here. 100%. That's for sure. Yeah. It was with us the whole way. Two, one, your winners Burley heads. They keep it rolling. <laughs> yeah. The easiest question and three out of the four teams got it wrong. Burley. Burley. 2009. Uh -oh. Two thousand no, two thousand eleven wasn't it? Uh -oh. Twenty thirteen. Twenty thirteen. No way. Twenty thirteen. <laughs>